Ava and I'm outside today because after our story, we are going to be doing a science experiment. <laughs> but first, we're going to read our story. And today's story is Whatever Happened to the Dinosaurs by Bernard Most. Whatever Happened to the Dinosaurs. We love to visit the library and read all about dinosaurs. But where did all the dinosaurs go? They were so big and there were so many of them. Why did they disappear? Nobody knows. Even scientists are not sure. The more we read about them, the more we wonder whatever happened to the dinosaurs. Did all the dinosaurs go to another planet? Maybe they're on Jupiter or Mars. Or did a magi magician make all the dinosaurs disappear? Maybe the dinosaurs are wearing disguises and we just don't recognize them. Are the dinosaurs in the hospital? Or are they in jail? Maybe the dinosaurs are lost in the middle of the jungle. Were the dinosaurs mistaken for dragons? Or did pirates steal them away? Arr. Maybe the dinosaurs are living underground. Did all the dinosaurs go on vacation? Or do they only come out at night when we're fast asleep? Hoo, hoo. Could the dinosaurs be hibernating? Or did they shrink so we can't see them? Maybe the dinosaurs are at the North Pole. Ho, ho, ho. Are the dinosaurs underwater? Bloop, bloop, bloop. Or was there a shortage of dinosaur food? Are the dinosaurs playing hide and seek? Maybe someday somebody will discover whatever happened to the dinosaurs. The end. What do you guys think happened to the dinosaurs? Lots of scientists tell us that there were a lot of volcanoes erupting when the dinosaurs went extinct. So today, we are going to be making our very own volcano. And you only need a few simple things. So you can get a plate with a cup on top. I'm using a paper plate and a plastic cup, but you can use the cups and plates that you have at home. And then you're gonna need some vinegar. Ooh, stinky. And then you're gonna need some baking powder. See, it's nice and white, it looks like snow. And if you have it at home, you can do so, use some red food, food coloring. So what teacher Ava did is I put some brown Play-Doh around my cup to make it look like a volcano. What do you think? Does it look like a volcano? Okay, so we have our cup and our plate, and you're going to take your baking soda, the stuff that looks like snow, and you're going to take two big scoops, two tablespoons, and you're going to put that right in the middle of your volcano. Okay, and then you're gonna take your vinegar. Oh, but first I forgot, we need to add some food coloring. I'm gonna put three drops because I want mine to be really red. And now it's time for your vinegar. So you're gonna take your vinegar and pour it right in the center of your volcano. Okay, count down with me. Ready, in three, two, one, go! just like when the dinosaurs were there. All right, now it's your turn to make a, make a volcano. What color are you gonna make your volcano? And what do you think happened to the dinosaurs? All right, I hope you have fun. See you. Bye-bye.